is up, guys. Let me tell you something. Ollie's. <clears throat> Ollie's came through with the clutch. $5.99. This is $20 value, they say. 10 different comic books for $5.99. Like, for real. I don't know what's in here. I didn't open it yet. I just got home. This is my second day going to Ollie's. I went to Ollie's yesterday because I wanted to find some stuff for my, for my niece. Um, like some, I am the aunt that gets like, um, educational stuff and, and electronics and stuff like that. So I ended up getting her like books and, you know, things like that. And, you know, stuff that she can grow, uh, use to grow, like stuff that'll prepare her for school, stuff like that. Anywho. So today I went back out there Dude, <laughs> y'all know how much I love my graphic novels. R.I.P. Comic Bento. Um, and, uh, you know, I don't really read comics per se, but I love graphic novels. Ollie's have a really nice size graphic novel section. They also sell comics. They have these. Where you can get like they had they had one that had eight of them, um, a eight uh, value pack. They have a ten value pack. So let's open this and see what you get for your money. So like five dollars and ninety nine cents, y'all, for ten ten comics. Like I said, I have no idea what's in here. Um, so we are about to find out what is in here. I guess this is going to be ruined once I open it because, oh, it's a big ginormous slab of tape. So, um, but yeah, I was so excited when I saw that Ollie's was selling comic books. I'm like, dude, stop playing. $5.99 y'all. $5.99. So yeah, let's see what you get. Because I really couldn't tell what all you would get in this um, stack. So <clears throat> first thing we see here, as you saw, this says Ian Fleming's uh, James Bond 007, Permission to Die, written and illustrated by Mike Grell. So um, yeah, 20 bucks is the regular price for this lot of comics and they have them for $5.99 like okay that's what's up next we have um static the shocking origin dc um so this is cool like this this is really cool to me. Like I said, I really don't, again, I don't read comics per se. I'm more of a graphic novel person <coughs> because I would prefer to have um, the whole volume rather than reading the individual comics and then having to keep up with the comics and see how flimsy and stuff and everything. So yeah, next we have, um, what is this? Steed and Mrs. Peel. Okay. Based on the hit TV show, The Avengers. All right, cool. So, you know, I like stuff like this. It's kind of like a grab bag of sorts. So you don't know what you're getting. And that's cool to me, you know, because I couldn't tell by looking at the spine, which, you know, you just saw just now. I couldn't tell like what exactly I was getting because you see comics, they don't have a spine. So you can't really tell what it is. Next, we have <clears throat> House of M sketchbooks. So... I'm assuming this is something, so you can, oh, okay, okay, so that's odd, that's different, so, you know, just little things like this, this is, I wouldn't consider this a comic, but, okay, this says direct edition, what, I don't know, whatever, I don't know, is this like a, like a promo type thing, but, okay, I don't know much about this but okay uh three rivers comic con pittsburgh pennsylvania so i'm assuming they got this from this so here's their promo so www.3riverscomiccon.com facebook 
Three Rivers Comic Con and Twitter at Three Rivers Comic Con. So I'll tag them in the video. So that's cool. <clears throat> We're going to put you down here. Next, we have um, Infinity Inc. So um, here's another one. So yeah, this is this is cool. Like seriously, I like I said, I've never been in Ollie's before. And when I went in there, I was like, oh, this is nice. Okay. So it's like they have like name brand stuff, but you could get them at like um, cheap prices. They say up to like 70% off. And see, this regular price is like $3.99. So, you know, I paid like six bucks for this whole lot. So that's like really not bad. And they say retail value is like 20 bucks for this whole lot so yeah i'm not complaining at all and again it's a grab bag so you don't know what you're getting so this is another way of you to actually um get into something that you may otherwise uh either not find look at this 3.99 that you may otherwise not find or <clears throat> not pick up on your own so here is a comic book called gamora so, yeah, so this is, this is neat. This is really neat. And, um, I hope that they continue with this. I really do. I hope they continue to bring in graphic novels and comics because the only other place I knew to get graphic novels and not so much as comics, but graphic novels would be like Barnes and Nobles or Books A Million, if you guys are familiar with that. Now, I don't have a Books A Million near me anymore. It's only Barnes & Noble. So, um, <clears throat> to be able to get graphic novels at a cheaper price at elsewhere, honey, I'm all for it. Because graphic novels are freaking expensive as all get out. So, here we have um, Mike Grell, uh, Shaman's Tears. That looks interesting. And this is what two fifty. So um, yeah. So the see those these are so cool. Like this is so cool to me. I love it. And I saw others, but they all had the same style number. So I don't know if they all had the same exact comics in them, or if they were the same type grouping of comics so i did not get anything other than this particular stack because they had tons of different ones but they all had the same style number so that's why i did not i did not grab the other ones because i don't know if they're all the same this one says free so <clears throat> is this like a free comic book day type thing but generally if it's a free comic book day thing it would say free comic book day but because uh, I know that they do like the free comic book day thing, like in terms of like when movies are coming out, they'll like pass out like a promotional comic or whatever for that or whatnot. So, but free. And last but not least, we have X-Men Ultimate. This is a thicker comic. Um, and this says direct edition too. So I have no idea what that means. This one is $3.95. <clears throat> so you comic book connoisseurs let me know what that means is that like the distributor like what does direct edition mean i have no idea but um so yeah here we go this is um three four five six seven eight nine ten so yeah there's ten comics here again uh this one is marked free so like, and then this one, it says it's a sketchbook. So, like, do you consider these, like, genuine comic books or whatnot? Like, if they don't have the little barcodes and stuff on it? Because some of them don't have the barcodes with the SKUs and the prices. And some of them says say direct edition. Some of them actually have price tags. Some of them don't. So, like... 
you know, how would you guys um, rate this lot of comics? And for five ninety nine, I still say that it's a great, it's a great deal. Especially like, oh, dude, y'all got Ollie's? You need to go to a Ollie's and check it out. Ollie's, I'm happy with you guys thus far. Y'all will be my number one go to for books, definitely, and for comics and for graphic novels. I am thoroughly pleased, and I hope you guys continue to do so with this you know, with this setup, I know that people go there for like, you know, children's toys and stuff like that too. But for me, I think y'all are going to be my, my kickoff for like books and, and graphic novels and comics. And I need to know what this means. I need to know what this style number means. So indie comics or, uh, three river comics con or whatnot, Y'all happen to see this? Let me know. Like, if does this mean that all the comics are the same comics in this style, or are they? Is that just a particular like how y'all group these together? Because I would have gotten more, but I didn't want the chance getting the same thing. So that'll be it for this video. I don't want to make this entirely too long. Thank you all for watching. If you are not currently subscribed to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe subscribe button for more videos coming here in the near future this is lynn aka ipod one reviewer till next time guys take care be safe love one another we'll see you all later peace